President Assad is toppled, what happens to Christians in Syria? Uh, what happened to them in Iraq and in other countries? Uh, out of 1 and 1.5 million Christians in Iraq, how many are left there? 300, 350,000? Mm -hmm. Christians in the Middle East have been there for 2,000 years since the beginning of Christianity. And now we are really worried that these Christian presence, which is good not only for Christianity, but for the whole region, because they've always been a source of uh, enlightenment, of uh, knowledge, and so forth. And they helped build that civilization. Now a time will come when they are driven out of their homelands and uh, forced one way or another to leave. That is very worrying to all of us. You use the word homeland. Syria yes. is your homeland. It is. I was born in Syria. And my homeland is not only Syria, it's the whole Middle East, because we, I come from the Syriac or Aramaic mm. race, which were when they, the population uh, made up the population of the whole region. So it is my homeland, and it will continue to be. Where, this is my adopted land, of course, mm. but Syria is my homeland. It must, yes. be, it must be heartbreaking for you. It is for me and for many people. I have family, but I'm not talking about personally here. I'm talking about the country itself, about the Christian and Muslims. We live together for. 1,500 years peacefully. Now, neighbors are not able to look, to see eye to eye to each other. That's very worrying. Your Eminence, we will talk some more, sir. We thank you for coming in. Thank you. Thank you for having me.